Yo guys, and welcome to another episode of Mr. Gav's Vlogs. In today's episode, we're doing something crazy, something exciting, something I've wanted to do since I picked this car up. We are at MSL Performance today, and we are doing a stage two upgrade. The power is gonna be crazy. The flames are gonna be crazy. This whole car is gonna become a machine. So Asan from MSL already has a stage two McLaren. This is one that's already been done. He has put me on a drive in it before, before I decided this is something I want to do in my McLaren. But you know what? I'm feeling like I just need to check it out one more time. So he's going to take me for a spin in his stage two McLaren again. And we'll show you exactly what his stage two McLaren can do. So you can see the replicated results on my McLaren. Can't even hear me. <laughs> Ready, bro? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. I'm surprised I'm still here. I'm out of heart attack. <laughs> Crazy. It's good for a 570, innit? That is mad. That wait. is mad. Just wait till we finish this. You wanna tell them how that was, bro? My blood pressure, yeah? Yo. That's mad. I need like two minutes. I just need everyone to just leave me alone for two minutes to take that in. Cause I'm sure I'm having a heart attack right now. <laughs> That'll be on your cast very, very soon. Later this week we'll have it done. Yo, I don't know. You need to give me driving lessons. Yeah, you, said, you said that's <laughs> I said to I said to him I'll give him some driving lessons. I said driving lessons are needed if this is what you're gonna do to my car, because yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna drive that. <laughs> Okay, so we've got the McLaren on the ramp now. It's gonna have the downpipes fitted as you can see, it's gone for catless downpipes. It's gone for the stage two mapping and stuff like that as well. So when the ECU is back from America, we'll show you his map selection. I'm gonna hand it over to Mobs now, who's our downpipe specialist, and he's gonna run through all the bits and pieces. All right, lads, so we've got this nice 570 GS. So we're changing these, putting these bad boys in. In order to do these, take the diffuser off, wheel off, wheel arch liners off, top cover off, bottom trays off, and then just crack at it from there, basically. So we've got the wheel off, wheel arch liner off, under tray off, diffuser off, gets access to it. Now, here's our down pipes, cat pipe, cats, what you want to call them, they run across here, they come all the way at the top. So next step is take this lamp sensor off, take this lamp sensor off, then hopefully open this bolt here, this bolt, two around the back, hopefully they open, and then we'll unclamp it and then we'll slide it at the top. So let's see how that goes. So the ECU is now back from America. If you have a look, M Engineering has packaged it up and sent it back to us. What we've got is the M-Tuner software. So with this, you get your laptop and everything like that. You can connect this and do your own data logs, flash your own maps and stuff like that. Um, we can also send data logs back and forth and check everything just to make sure everything's safe on the vehicle. ECU is in here and we're gonna get this fitted now. So stick with us to see this on the vehicle. Okay guys, so the McLaren 570S is now on the dyno. It's got the downpipes fitted, M Engineering mapping done and switchable maps. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do stock runs, we're gonna do stage two runs, and then we're gonna do pops, bangs, and flames. So stick with us, because this is gonna be a very good one.
Yo guys, it's been a whole week now and we are back at MSL picking up the beast, okay? Everyone's been telling me it is crazy. It's a new animal, it's a whole different machine now. So yeah, let's take a look and let's listen. Rev it up, bro. What the f I'm speechless. I might need to start the car. I don't know if I can handle that, you know? <laughs> It's crazy. I don't know what happened to my lungs though, standing at the back of that, but whoa. What you do is you go into your pops and bangs mode, which is number three. Yeah, so, so that'll be stage two, four you're power. neutral and you're just using this here yeah, towards just, you first. No, push it back first. Okay, and then it'll go it zero and, and back up. And then you can move it up and down then. It, okay, and then how so do you select it? Leave you it move at number it, three. Nah, you just select it oh, on okay. it and it will just come up by itself. itself. Then just double check it by pushing it back and it'll go to the number three. You know, all right, I'm in back three. Yeah, yeah. My pops and bangs and stuff like that. Revving wise, you can just put it into active mode and rev it as normal. Yeah. But if you want the big, big bangs, put on the brake, um, put it in drive, handbrake down, and then hit the launch button. Okay. And you see that say launch initiating, and then. Oh, and are you just holding it on three revs there, or are you no, max bottle? You're max bottle. Okay. The car does the bangs and stuff like that. Okay, so you don't need to rev it up and down. You don't need, you don't need to, to rev it up and down anything. Okay, that. that's it. <laughs> Easy. Yeah. Exactly, bro. So I'll let you try it now. Yeah. And see how you can do Perfect. it. Perfect. The feet black to the floor. Bloody hell. But it's easy. <laughs> Yo guys, it's that time again. It is the end of the vlog. And you know what? I'm impressed with the car. Yesterday we took it to the D-Max 250 event and they loved it. People loved it. It was crazy. It's spitting fire out the back. Yo, I'm so excited. I'm so happy. I'm gonna love this car. I'm gonna keep this now probably for the next year or two. I'm buying another car which is about to go rose gold as well. So keep an eye out for that. But for now, all I need to tell you guys is make sure you like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you on our next video.